So now let's check out how did we get to this beautiful place of St. Moritz. We have started our journey from Davos. Davos to St. Moritz it's around 73 kilometers which took us around 1 hour 45 minutes to reach St. Moritz. St. Moritz is a posh ski resort. It is located in the Engadin Valley in the Swiss Alps. Its frozen lake is home to polo, cricket and horse racing on snow. In addition to their well-maintained cross-country ski trails, the Corvigla and Diovelza and Corvach mountains offer skiing and snowboarding. Not only that, while we travel from Davos to St. Moritz, we get to see a very scenic route. The town of St. Moritz is located 1865 meter above the sea level. For the reason, now you would be able to experience our climb from Davos minus two right now and the view which I came across was so 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 amazing I mean it was you know as if we were cutting through glacier and we were coming and I think it's snowing is it yeah. 
Yeah, the small flakes knowing. So this place is really amazing. I mean, just have a look. We have been to a similar place like this, uh, which was in New Zealand. Uh, something, something of this sort was Fiordland. However, when we crossed Davos and um, we got into St. Moritz, suddenly, you know, the topography, the climate, the landscape, everything so vastly changed, what changed. And now all I see in front of me is snow. It's snow all around. So when we were passing through, uh, the, the, we, was, we were crossing those glaciers, you know, it was an ice burst kind of a thing which we experienced and that was so mesmerizing. That was something, you know, which I've never ever experienced and now it's so cold. Oh God. Alright, so we are about to hit the city of St. Moritz um, in another, say what, um, 10 to 15 minutes. So this was on our way and now we are going to hit the city of St. Moritz and then I'm going to show you more of it. Meanwhile, I will let you guys enjoy the view. Here we are, almost there. I can see the St. Moritz Lake, well it's frozen, but yet looks Amazing. St. Moritz is known as the world's number one alpine holiday destination. It is not surprising that the Winter Olympic Games were held not once but twice here in the heart of the fascinating Upper Engadin Lake District. What's more, the Albula and the Bernina routes of the Rayton Railway are included on the UNESCO World Heritage List, making this sun-kissed alpine metropolis the world's only destination to have both UNESCO as well as Olympic game credentials. St. Morris continued making history throughout the modern era. It was here that Switzerland's first electric light was switched on and the country's first electric tram took onto the tracks. St. Morris is also home to Europe's first ever palace hotel. Here we are enjoying That's some coffee one. alongside some hot chocolate for me with some small little shoe pastry in this cold weather and a view outside like this. So this is the frozen lake and I can't believe that I'm standing on it. <laughs> I just hope it does not break and I just don't go inside it. But it seems like I won't because there's a lot of people who are walking here along with you know kids. So I don't think there's a chance. But this looks so cool yeah. This frozen lake is home for many of the sports like polo, cricket and horse racing on snow. So interesting and all in this ultra chic town of St. Moritz. <laughs> 